Luke Tanaka joined by head volleyball coach Julie Hall. Three and one record at the Elmhurst Invitational, one and one at the UW Whitewater Triangular. How do you assess the team so far this year, just two weeks in? We are still finding our way. Um, even though we have a, a veteran team, a lot of returners, there is there are new kids in every position and the lineup. I think Hannah Nimerick and Allie Rogers are the only two steadies from last year. Um, Melissa Nava is coming back, but in a new position. We have a couple of new folks in the back line, so we're still we're struggling at times to find our way. Start with Hannah Nimerick. She's an all-conference, all-region, all-American. Uh, what has she done this summer to up her level, perhaps even more, to continue to contribute to this team? I think just the experience piece of it is huge for her and the maturity of, as far as leadership goes with the team. That's what we're looking forward to with Hannah more than anything right now. And just a consistency with the outsides. I mean, that's that's been something that she's worked hard on um, and con continues to work with. So it's just that consistency with our pin hitters. Yeah, Melissa Nava back on the floor. I feel pretty good to see her back out there after the tough injury. Now you're moving to the outside, I believe. She's moved out there, trying to get a new position. How has she adjusted? You know, it, it, that's the toughest position to go from a middle to an outside because the timing issue is incredible. So um, I'm so happy for, for her. I, don't, I didn't know that she was going to be able to do it uh, because that's her forte has been the middle hitter, but she has adjusted fantastically, and it's because she has a mindset to do it and to be perfect in it. So um, just the fact that she was all tournament that first weekend, um, kudos to her. You, like you said, you have a lot of experience coming back to this year. It was a pretty young team last year. They were able to cut their teeth a little bit last year. Do you think that's going to help as the season goes on this year, especially once you get into those CCIW games? I mean, I'm hoping so. Um, <laughs> right now we're still, again, it's just kind of in flux and finding the right group and the right lineup. Um, we've taken Hannah Davis out of the middle, too, at times, and she's been playing two and three positions for us just to trying to find our niche. So it's going to be a while, but I'm thinking, you know, we always work for the end, and that's what we're looking forward to. Conference road starts very soon. You got Wheaton on Wednesday. Last year, conference schedule was a little tough for the Blue Jays. So about this year, how do you want to come in and make a statement in the conference going on the road to Wheaton? The thing is, the CCIW every year has gotten better and better. Just the fact that we had three teams in the NCA, we're looking forward to that again this year. Um, there is not one give me in the entire conference, and Wheaton's going to bring a lot of talent. Shelby Knowles is amazing on the outside, and um, she's supported by a great group of athletes. I think they also are struggling with just trying to find their niche, but they're they're really a team to be a force to look at, and we're going to have to play our best game on Wednesday. And then three national powerhouses at the Wittenberg Tournament, Cal Lutheran, Wash U, and then Wittenberg. It's a very tough slate for this team, uh, but what are you looking forward to to have, see, have them see that kind of top ten potential that they'll see across the net? They, we have to look at that. They have to, um, you know, we're going to have to bite the bullet and see where we have to really focus with this group. And they also have to pull themselves up and be able to play at that kind of level. And so we'll see. I mean, it's going to be a great tournament, and we're looking forward to it. Coach Hall, thanks for joining me. Good luck in this against Wheaton and then in the tournament as well. Thanks so much. I appreciate it.